Alright guys, this is the guy JP here back with another video and um if you saw my last video thank you for the support and uh so hopefully you subscribe so you can see this one. So um this is another squad builder that I have and uh it's for the Asia Cup, you know how Ultimate Team has their featured cups, you know, every week or maybe every five days. I don't really pay attention to it that much. This time it's Asia, so you need to have either Six players from the Korean Republic or six players from Australia. They can be intertwined. But uh, Australia sucks, basically. They have no good players and all their silvers are expensive. So I just integrated some Koreans right here. And uh, so six Koreans don't go over the max. I mean, if you want to, go ahead. But normally they're not that good. I mean, um, three gold Koreans is what I have in my team. But, uh, so this is, this is a good squad, a pretty good squad that you could build to make, um, or to play in this cup. So, you know, we have, um, Son right here. I mean, if you, when you have the Korean team, you have to get Son, because he's like 86 pace, 78 shot, pretty good. Um, four, five star weak foot, three star scope moves, that's... That's really good. The only problem is that he's a bit expensive. I've got him for 950 coins. And a player like him, you should be able to get him for cheaper. Like, But, you know, that's just Ultimate Team. And I'm sure the prices rose just for this cup. But, um, yeah. <laughs> that's basically it. When the cups are going on, if there's, like, players from unheard of nations or, like, where you don't normally buy them, their prices are going to rise. And, um, so this formation here is a 3 4 2 1. And, uh, I like it. So I did a hybrid with the Bundesliga because both Son and, uh, Chul here, they're both from the Bundesliga. And, um, then Bundesliga, you know, is a pretty good league. So I try to just modify it around that. So then it should be a good team. And, um, Try to get try to get high chemistry, honestly. I mean, you could just put them in wherever. You could just put, like, the best players from the nation in wherever. And, um, but then you'll have low chemistry. And when I first started FIFA, I didn't think chemistry mattered that much. But honestly, when you're playing, it does. I just played a guy with Falcao, Benzema, Sterling, Modric. I mean, I bet he spent a whole bunch of money on this game and a lot of coins on this game. And I beat him 2-1. to one. I mean, he scored in the 90th minute. It didn't really matter. I was already up 2-0. And I have bronzes in my team. He even substituted out his uh, bronze players from, like, Australia and Korea to put in some gold players. He put in Falcao at, like, halftime. He put in um, Benzema. And he already had Sterling there and Modric. I mean, those are those players cost a lot of coins, especially Modric and Falcao. And um, this team is pretty cheap, honestly, under 20k. Whenever you're doing hybrids, always try to get the green bonds between players. Always try to get the green chemistry. I mean, I think I have a better player than Nocha here. But then he wouldn't have the green chemistry with Adler... Ho Hovidus and Bad Stuber here, and then my chemistry would go down. It's at 97 right now. I wanted it to be 100, but I mean, you can't always get it at 100. I have two red bonds right here between Nocha and um, Wu, and between uh, Jai and Boateng. Um, but then, you know, get the managers. Honestly, get the mag managers. They really help. Don't buy them for like over 300 coins, honestly. Just try to snipe on the auction block. Just look for it. Uh, just refine your search. Whenever you're on the auction block, just refine your search as much as possible. Then you should be able to find the best buy. So, I've played two games so far, only in the cup. And I've won 2-0 to zero and 2-1. to one. And uh, with these players, if you can score at least two goals, then that's pretty good. I mean, you just need to hope that your defense plays good and your the team that you're facing isn't just OP. And these teams shouldn't be OP unless somebody just puts them in where, I, like, they might have Messi and Ronaldo. Honestly, doubt it, though. Honestly, doubt that you'll get uh, matched up with somebody like that. But, um, 
Yeah, so so this team, it's under it's under 20k, I know for sure. But but uh so let's review each of the players. So Jaira here. Um two games with me, one assist. That's that's fine. 80 pace. Um honestly, if you're if you're going to buy players like this like silvers and bronze, just look for pace. I know that there's another guy uh for Korean that who is in the K League. That wanted to match up with a uh, Gook here, and I thought I had him for a good price, but then he was like around five thousand coins. And because rewards, it's five thousand coins in a jumbo gold pack or just a premium gold pack. Don't don't spend too much money on the team because you might not like the team, and you're only gonna use him for a few games unless you lose. And uh, that happens to me before, but I try to whenever I do those weekly tournaments try to use players that you already have if you buy players don't sell them right away try to keep them don't quick sell everybody unless you have people in that position that you like to use that are better than them then quick sell them sell them on the auction block whatever but if you have players just keep them because you never know what's going to come up you never know what squad you want to build and um so and yeah and on these weekly tournaments do not spend a lot of coins because most of the times they won't pay off. You won't win with the team because there might be somebody with an even better team where they might have high rated players, you know, like Di Maria, Falcao, Messi even, Ronaldo even. So just don't spend a lot of coins into this team. I mean right here, four hundred and fifty coins for sixty six silver, that's a lot. But I just wanted to make this team so I could give this uh team to you. And Gook right here, he is pretty good. If you're going to do the Korean team, get Gook. I mean, 64 pace, that is not good. But 81 shot and 72 pass, that's pretty good. 4-star weak foot, 3-star skill moves. 68 physicality, that's, I mean, when you're 6'2", I don't know how you have 68 physicality. But he, I think he has a header for me. Yeah, I mean, two games, two goals. He has a header for me, and then there was one where he tapped it in out, off a rebound. So, I uh, I would definitely recommend getting him. He has great uh attacking position. Like it does it, that's why I don't like. They don't show that on the screen, but or like on his um ultimate team stats, but he does have good attacking rating. Then Jai and Lee, I don't know. I'm probably not just say their last names, but 61 center forward, two bought for 200 coins. He he scored a goal for me and it was a nice goal. He, uh, I went, I was running down with him through the middle, fake shot, and then I rocketed it into the right corner, right top corner, and I thought it was Gook or Sone or something, but it was a 61 center forward, bronze player. 75 pace, that's decent. 60 shot, 62 pass. I mean, just, just try to look for pace. If you have enough skill, that doesn't matter that much. Just look for pace. I mean, 75 pace is not the best, but look for somebody because the, the low bronze players, they don't have high attributes like shooting and passing. So look for pace. I mean, four star weak foot, three star skills. That's good. I mean, I bought him for 200 coins. This guy, 200 coins. Nothing stands out, but he could get the job done just to boost chemistry. Chiol here, I I had a crazy finesse shot with him. He he is a pretty good uh, player. He might get a, a bit expensive, but just refine your search as much as, as much as possible, and you can get him for six hundred fifty coins. That's what I got him for. Four star weak foot, four star skills. Then Sone eighty six pace. That you can't really go wrong with him. He's just somebody put in the team. That's for Korean. I mean, if you want a Bundesliga team, maybe. But besides that, that's it. Boateng here, I use him for my Bundesliga. He's a he's a really solid p player, um, very well rounded. Seventy defense, seventy seven pace, eighty shot, seventy eight pass, four star weak foot, four star skill moves. That's those are great stats. Just he he could you could even put him at CDM if you want. Then you got the green strand with Hovidis here, Bad Stuber, and Noche. And then Adler, I think he is the best goalkeeper in the Bundesliga. I mean, I don't play, I don't play um, Ultimate Team enough. I don't pull packs for me to get Neuer. 
I'm not going to buy Neuer. He's, I haven't checked his price in a while, but I know it's crazy. So Adler here, only 800 coins, and I will get some gameplay with him. But he is just very good.